<laughs> oh. Oh shit, shit, shit. Oh! All my guns. Set the scene, and we're gonna put this target at 22 feet. Apparently, it's gonna do 20 feet, but it wanted 22. Yes, yes. All right. So as you can see here, you know, we can do several things. We can take this one bullet, and take this one bullet, and put it in the gun. Right. Now we got this one bullet in the gun. Let's see what we can do. That's right. Oh, that one bullet, look guys, at 22 feet. That's one bullet at 22 feet. Oh. I'm gonna go ahead and just put that down for now. We're gonna put on the scoop. Put on our scoop. There we go. Put that down. We're gonna bring this guy back over here. <laughs> it's a lemon. Put one of these back in there. Close it up. And let's aim it like right there at that. <laughs> there we go. Put the match down. Pick up this hot dog here. Yep, you gotta worry about these hot dogs. Light it. Oh shit! Ow! Put them onto your belt so that when you're running around, you can easily pick up a gun that you already have preloaded, ready to go. Boom, boom. Hot dogs, horseshoes, and hand grenades. That's right. Hot dogs, horseshoes, and hand grenades. Because it all makes sense. I don't have that much time, but I do really, really want to try out this game. So I'm going to. I'm going to take the little time that I have before I have to go to work, and I'm going to play this game. It's called Hot Dogs, Horseshoes, and Hand Grenades. And you can play it with the Vive currently until you get the motion controllers with Oculus Rift. But I actually have the DK2 and the Razer Hydra, so just come on. It still works. It still works. It's gonna make me small. And I've got some room scale going on here. As you can see, as you're looking through here, I can actually, you know, walk around this area pretty easily. You know, I can come take a look at all these things, and whoop, that one is a little bit of lost tracking. And, you know, I can, I can actually move around pretty well and see my area get real down far in there. <laughs> Early access update number four. Make sure to check the latest dev log. I have not checked it yet, but horseshoes, hot dogs, horseshoes, and hand grenades, rest LTD. All right, so the first thing I usually start from the left to the right. Um, let's go ahead and hit Arizona Duelin'. Boop. <laughs> I like that. Boop. Okay, let's test this out. I do know UK Rifter put up a video of this earlier, but I did not actually take a chance to look at his because I wanted to experience it for the first time, and wow, this is beautiful. I can tell I'm in somewhat of a limited, smaller area, but the, the, the landscape is beautiful. It's not just a, a plain 360 photo. They've actually got a nice textured area, which is cool. Um, fire in line. Okay. Looks like a fire in line's there. And I can come pick up all the stuff over here, so... Interesting. Dynamite. Okay. Oops. All right. I'm not sure how I open it. 
Huh. <laughs> okay. This seems silly now. Alright. Ah, clicking the right thumbstick. Ha! <laughs> so I've got matches and I can actually match it. Come on. Oh! Oh, this is great! Oh, shit, shit, shit. Oh no, you can't throw with the Razor Hydras! I'm gonna blow up! Ah! All my guns! All my guns! It, it blew up all... It blew up all my guns. Okay. I need to go back. I need to go backwards. There we go. Oh, nice! I got a flame on my Zippo. Doing this again. Oh no. There we go. Ah. No! Oh wow, you saw my stuff still get blown up a bit. Let's check this out. And pick up one gun. Oh, oh. oh. oh, you actually gotta line it up too. I actually have to line it up proper. This is where having a vibe would make it really perfect. I'm looking. Oh. Uh. Okay, I got this now. I got this now. All right, I figured it out. We're gonna put the clip in. Oop, oop, oop. Get the clip in there. First, we get the clip in, right? All right, now the clip's in. We can. There we go. He's ready to go. Now, uh, now we're gonna put the gun down real quick. Just gonna put that gun down. Pick this gun up. All right, guys. There's no reason to go out and have to get yourself a real gun. We already got ammo in this one, it looks like. So we just pull this guy back. Yeah. Just like that. Pick him up, right? All right, now we got him. We're ready to go. Cowboys. All right, you ready, Cowboys? Draw. All right. All right. Pick up ammo here. This is awesome. That's awesome feeling. So I can disengage the barrel, pop it out, roll it back in, just literally roll it back in, just like gravity. Just like gravity would allow. You look at that, it's just got it's got that nice gravity mechanism with it. It locks in place, you gotta pop it out. That's amazing. These are modeled just extremely well. The physics are great. And of course, you see mine fidgeting around. It's because I'm using Razor Hydras and I'm not using, um, you know, the, the traditional <laughs> the traditional controllers, you know, that, that are supposed to come with it naturally. So as you can see, that actually balanced it out quite a bit. It looks a lot better. 
Alright, so what I can do is I can actually pick up bullets over here. I can pick up these individual bullets. Oh, and I can put the bullets in the gun. Wow, I, got, I really have to put in all every single one of them. This is so tedious. This is so tedious, but oh my gosh, it makes it so much more worth it. And do you imagine just a simple gun? Oh shit! That is why you don't play with guns. Because accidents happen. <laughs> there we go. Wow. That's so crazy looking right there. This feels powerful. <laughs> this feels very powerful. Wow. How do I get my bolts to come out? Uh, indoor range. Oh wow. Type in range in feet. And then hit the dot to move the target. Well, I want it to be about 15 feet. 51 feet, that's too far. This is amazing. I love that. Are you guys seeing what I'm seeing right now? This is... <laughs> this is very clever. This is very clever. We've got just a little bit of 3D ambiance. The lighting is just great. The lighting looks really good in here. The fact that I can change my target setting just as easily as that. I've got three different guns here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pick up the gun that we haven't seen yet. Oh, whoa. And we'll go ahead and just move that down. This is going to let us look at an individual bullet. That's insane. I just, I, I just put an individual bullet in here. Comes out automatically. Alright. Got it. Right. All right. I just reset the scene, and we're going to put this target at 22 feet, apparently. I was going to do 20 feet, but it wanted 22. Yes, yes. All right, so as you can see here, you know, we can do several things. We can take this one bullet, and we can take this one bullet and put it in the gun, right? Now we got this one bullet in the gun. Let's see what we can do. That's right. Go ahead. I want to see. Oh, that one bullet. Look, guys, at 22 feet. That's one bullet at 22 feet. All right. We're going to go ahead and put that back down. Now we're going to put it at 25 feet. Go ahead, 25 feet. And beep, beep, beep. Go ahead and put this in here now. Oh, 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 oh. I can't get, there we go. Swap guns. There we go, it's loaded now. It's locked and it's loaded. You ready for this? <laughs> Go ahead and put that gun down. 
Yep, there was the one from earlier, and out of our barrage of shots, we got one, two, three little crazy guys, four good ones, and, you know, two much betters. That guy, that's your kill shot right there. So uh, the rest were just to scare them, and, uh, of course, we're talking about animals or, if you're in Florida, intruders. Um... <laughs> points it got worse it got way way worse all right this this is what I've been waiting for um, what is this what kind of futuristic free bolt there Wow, yep. Yep, this one has way less ricochet. Super badass. Super badass gun right there. Just figuring out how to shoot each gun is a task, especially if you're somebody like me and does not, uh, you know, know the stuff already. So, all right, now we've got it ready. I'm gonna put it down actually for a quick second. Readjust my hands. Oh shit! That's why you shouldn't put the safety off when you pick it up. All right. Oh, my little, my little belt looks like dangles from it. This is awesome. This is crazy. All right. Ah, so I got, I got burst. I got one shot. Five shots. Nice. That's right. And then we can also go over here. We can take it to burst shot. Look at that. <laughs> Get rid of that. Go ahead and put the other ammo in there. Gonna go ahead and reset that one. One shot, eight points, great. Um, oh, I can hold that. I should have. You gotta be holding that. That'll make it a little more sturdy. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this. Oh, oh I can set the height of my. I can actually set the height of it. That's awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and just put that down for now because we're gonna put on the scope. Put on our scope. There we go. Excellent. Okay, I can see through the scope pretty well. We've got our new ammo. It's loaded. We're set on burst mode right now. And uh, now that we're set on burst mode, 
Everything is ready to rock. Let's One, go, guys. Two, three. That's right. Put that down. We're going to bring this guy back over here. Come on. Ooh. You s <laughs> It was just going up and down. As obviously I had the recoil. You see, what happens is I think I started it right in the center there. And as soon as you start shooting, it starts going up. And then I come back down, trying to recompensate for it. So you can actually see my actual whole pattern here is right here, coming up, around, and coming back down, trying to compensate for it. So that's so cool. I can actually see my pattern. Anyway, um, I've done a lot of target practicing in real life, just never with these actual guns. So this is a, an amazing experience to be able to have just in the first place. So um, we're going to go back to the main menu. I've been taking forever on just the basic stuff. Arcade experiment. Oh, what the fuck? So that's because I'm using, of course, the DK2 that doesn't have 360 tracking. Ah! <laughs> it's a lemon. Ah! Oh, what a great concept. <laughs> it's like the same dude. It's like the same dude making the sounds for each of these. throw stuff. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> that stuff keeps happening to me. Distance start reset. First digit of number targets, second digit of number waves, third and fourth digits of second to shoot them. Try five nine. Oh crazy. Things is <laughs> Let's try this again. Put one of these back in there, close it up, and let's aim it like right there at that. <laughs> That's so cool. All right, is this a gas grenade? Concussion grenade. Oh. oh shit. Oh my stuff's gone again. I reset the scene at once. This is crazy. Of 
course. Of course we could try this one out with my lightsaber. There we go. Put those matches down. Pick up this hot dog here. Yep, you gotta worry about these hot dogs. Light it. Okay. Oh shit! Ow! Eat it! Eat it before it blows up! That's what happens when you eat hot dogs here in America. Oh wow! No! No, this is amazing looking. This is amazing looking. Jerk balls and Falandorn have everything. Handgun sequence, high scores. No way. I'm gonna get good at this stuff. I love this kind of stuff. These games are some of the most favorite. Anytime it's got like a sports or a kind of a competitive type of a game to it, I just really, really enjoy playing it. Um, but first, of course, I need to learn how to Helps if you put the right clip in the gun. Golly. I don't have more. Ready now. I'm ready. Yeah, you guys see that? It took me forever to figure that out. But uh, apparently, you can actually just take the, the guns and put them onto your belt so that when you're running around, you can easily pick up a gun that you already have preloaded, ready to go, and boom, boom, boom. So I'm going to have pistols sitting there, and those will be my backups when I'm reloading these guys on the side. And I can just pull out the pistols as I need to go. Casper Hush. Um, this is a, an amazing setup. It's an amazing simulator as well as like an actual, you know, relevant, you know, the more accurate they make it, the more... <laughs> the more accurate that they make it, the more relevant uh, it'll be even used for people that are actually, you know, in the field and whatnot. So um, I'm, I'm really excited to see what more I can do with this. Um, and of course, we do have one more thing to look at. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. I don't know if I, I don't think I can do this one with the with the Razor Hydra. This one doesn't work, I don't believe. So <laughs> this looks awesome. Little little fun things like this on the side. Yeah. See, you have to throw it. I don't think. Yeah. There's no. <laughs> Unfortunately, when I throw. Yeah, even, even for me, sad, sad day. Ski ball was going to be one of the ones I was excited about because you can, of course, pull the pin. You, you just got to throw it. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, it's going <laughs> to. So anyway, you get the idea. This would be a really, really fun little game that you could play where you can throw the grenades out there and play ski ball with them. Unfortunately, I don't have that option. So. There you are, hot dogs, horseshoes, and hand grenades. I will, uh, this is, a, this is a great game. I will definitely revisit this game more and more. I'm gonna try to break some of those records, because anytime you give me a chance to break some records, I'm gonna do so. Um, <laughs> drop the controller there. And also, if I get the opportunity to try this with the, the Vive, I'm going to do that immediately. Um, but most of all, once I get motion controllers with the, with the CV1, I'll be able to do that. So, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Definitely, if you have a chance, check out this game if you're into 
guns, fighting, shooting, you know, uh, this, this is just a really, really great, great realistic simulator, and it's the best I've seen out of the world. It, it, it's the most realistic that I've seen. Um, you can even move your safeties and everything, so a great job to develop in this game, and I'm really excited to see more of it, and uh, once again, let me know if you want to see more of this one, because I, I, I can't wait to check that game. I'll certainly be playing it. You know it's gonna happen. You know it's gonna happen. Alright, till next time.